what? Why kapak kapak? Mm, kapak. I actually wrote that down in my jer my agenda so I'd know how to spell it. All right, hit me. Don't actually hit me. Um, kappa 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 baras. That's what it was. Got it. But now I've got a geography geography question for you. Maybe I'll redo that one. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. Sure. Go. Oh, that, oh, that's the wrong, huh? <laughs> Africa, Antarctica. I can keep saying it's like polo in my head because there's that commercial that has like Marco Polo in the pool. Africa, Antarctica, Asia, China. But in the 1400s, this brave new trend of setting out to sail to find India and China. Africa. But in the 1400s, this I don't know why I keep pointing to like, burp, burp, burp. like Christopher Columbus, Vasco da Gama, and Ferdinand Gel Magellan. Ferdinand Gellin. He's chilling. Magellan. Africa, Antarctica, Asia, Europe. Also, I just kind of woke Max because he's asleep on my lap. Okay, hold on. Let's do that one again. But in the 1400s, right. And this new trend of reporting back that the world was much larger than previously Previously is not working out for me right now. Okay, take 500. Africa, Antarctica, Asia, Europe, China. That is when, oh, okay. Africa, Antarctica, Asia, China, Europe, North America, South America. I was like, you made me say all of the things, all of the names. I see you, Mr. Anderson, I see, I see your thing. Rah, 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 bizarro, bizarro. Pilgrims and the Winnipeg and Queen Elizabeth I and the Wampan Wampanoag <laughs> and Queen Elizabeth I. We'll do that one more time. Wampanoag, Wampanoag. Sometimes I just like a name, and the kids are like, "Yeah," and I'm like, "Yeah, <laughs> that one." <laughs> okay, hold on. Here we go. Francisco Pizarro. I can say it. Mary Wollstone, Wollstonecraft. The Berlin Conference? Oh, the oil. This is me being a spy. I don't, it's, this was supposed to be like hiding behind something, but then it like looks kind of weird. Um, <laughs> okay, maybe not. Hit me, but not really. Can you name the projects and fun activities will be completed? Hit me. Can you name the projects and fun activities will be com completed? Completing. The brain of the words and I'm gonna get it right. Um, I figured I would just keep rolling because I figured it would be a little more entertaining. And you're like, what is she gonna do next? You don't know. There's a survey attached to this video. Link and subscribe like and subscribe below. Okay, hold on. Right. Well, uh, just in case anyone doesn't know, Halton, it's like H-O-W-T-O-N. I know you know that, Mr. Anderson. Mr. Anderson. His is A-N-D-E-R-S-O-N, just in case you, it sounds as it's spelled phonetically. Um, or it sounds, phonetically sounds as it's spelled. You know what I mean. Okay, let me do that one one more time. Right. Well, on behalf of Mr. Anderson. And for me, Miss Halton, we wish you a great start to the school year. Have fun watching all of my bloopers <laughs> because that's what makes it so long. <laughs> my apologies.